As a general rule, relevant evidence is admissible at trial, but a trial judge has the discretion to exclude even relevant evidence to guard against issues like unfair prejudice to the defendant or unnecessary delay. The Second Circuit Court of Appeals considered whether the trial judge made the right call in United States v. Biagi. Former United States Congressman Mario Biagi and John Mariota, the founder and former chief executive of the WedTech Corporation, were among six defendants charged with a host of criminal violations stemming from a series of contracts WedTech received from the United States Department of Defense. Mariota's principal defense was that he was unaware of the other defendants' unlawful activities. The trial court didn't allow Mariota to introduce evidence that he rejected the government's offer of immunity for testifying against other defendants, which he argued was proof of his own lack of a guilty mind. But the court did allow the prosecution to present evidence that Mariota's wife withdrew a substantial sum of money from their joint account and transferred it to investments in her own name, which the prosecution argued showed consciousness of guilt. Mariota was convicted of bribery and other crimes. He appealed to the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit.